We have a simple question here on simultaneous linear equation. We have that 2x minus 3y equal to 5 minus x plus 2y equal to minus 3. Find x and y. See, at table of knowledge, we approach our mathematics questions step by step so that even the average student can follow. So those that have advanced knowledge in mathematics, please be patient with us. We have the question here. The first thing we are going to do is to think of how to eliminate any of the unknown. We may choose to eliminate x or we may choose to eliminate y. Whichever one we choose to eliminate, we think of how to make the coefficient to be equal. If we are to eliminate y, for example, we equate the coefficient of y. And if we are to eliminate s, we equate the coefficient of both s. Here, let us eliminate s so that we can solve for y. And one way to do that is to use the coefficient of this x to multiply everything in equation 1 and then use the coefficient of the x in equation 1 to multiply everything in the second equation. So we have this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. So we are going to multiply equation 1 by negative 1 which is the coefficient of this x and equation 2 by 2 which is the coefficient of that first x. Now let's multiply. Negative 1 multiply 2x will give us negative 2x. Minus 3y multiply minus 1 gives us plus 3y because minus times minus is plus. Equal to 5 multiply minus 1 is negative 5. Let's call this equation 3. Next, 2 multiply minus x is minus 2x. 2y multiply 2 gives us plus 4y equal to minus 3 multiplies 2 is negative 6. Let's call this equation 4. Okay, now that the coefficients of the two x are the same, they will both eliminate each other. Okay, and we are left with this. We are going to subtract equation 4 from equation 3. So we have 3y minus 4y equal to minus 5 minus in brackets minus 6 here 3y minus 4y we are left with minus y equal to minus 5 this minus multiply this minus gives us plus so that minus 5 plus 6 is equal to 1 now we are looking for y so anything attached to y should go so divide both sides by negative 1 here, this negative sign, we strike this and we are left with y divided by 1 is y equal to 1 divided by minus 1 is negative 1. And this becomes the value of y. Now that we have known the value of y, we are going to substitute this value in any of the equations above. We can substitute it in equation 1, equation 2, equation 3, or equation 4. Anyone will substitute it, will get the same answer. So let's substitute in equation 1. We have the equation 1 here. Wherever we find y, we are going to put negative 1 in place of y. So that we have 2x minus 3 in place of y, we put negative 1 equal to 5. 2x minus 3 multiply minus 1 gives us plus 3 equal to 5. Here, 2x equal to 5. 3 crosses over to minus. We divide both sides by 2. 2x divided by 2. Here, 5 minus 3 is 2. So we have 2 divided by 2. This 2, we eliminate this 2. We are left with x. So that s equal to 1. And this becomes the value of s. Therefore, x equal to 1. And y equal to negative 1. Thank you very much for watching. Please kindly give our page a review. Just click on the page name, scroll down a little, you will click on the review button and give us a review or a recommendation. Thank you very much.